Hello students, in today's class we will start the chapter number 11 metric system from ICAC Mathematics 5. So let's start the class. So uh, this exercise uh, we will be doing from exercise 11.1 page number 148 and this uh, exercise is given on page number 150. So the number one exercise is write the given measures in meters and centimeters. So we have to write the measure in meters and centimeters. So let's see first question question a 2.38 meter so how we are going to write these measures in meters and centimeters is the easy way of doing it is we have to see the number before point and after point so here before point is 2 and after point is 38 and as per the question we have to write the measures in meters and centimeters so here as 2 is before point so we have to write 2 meter and as the 38 is after point so we have to write 38 centimeter so the answer is 2 meter 38 centimeter next question B 0 0.45 meter so here before point is 0 so 0 is less than 1 so we are not writing anything for meter and 4 5 is after point so so the answer will be 45 centimeter next question question c 38.6 meter so before point is 38 38 so 38 meter 6 centimeter because 6 is after point and here we are measuring in meters and centimeters next question is D 125.79 meter so here again 125 is meter and 79.79 so that means it is after point so 79 centimeter so the answer is 125 meter 79 centimeter we'll see the next question next question again question e 0 0.85 meter and we are measuring this in meters and centimeters so here point 0 is before the point so 0 is less than 1 so we do we are not writing anything for meter so we have to write the numbers which are after point so after point is 0 0.85 so the answer is 85 centimeter next question question f 19.24 meter so here again the same process we follow 19 centimeter 24 19 meter and 24 centimeter this is the answer next question question g 86.42 meter so here again same process will follow 86 meter 42 centimeter because 86 is before point and 42 is after point so 86 meter 
फोर्टी टू सेंटीमीटर सो एच क्वेश्चन एच फोर थर्टी टू पॉइंट सिक्स नाइन मीटर अगेन विल फॉलो द सेम प्रोसेस बिफोर पॉइंट इज फोर थर्टी टू सो फोर थर्टी टू मीटर एंड आफ्टर पॉइंट सिक्स नाइन सो दैट मीन्स सिक्सटी नाइन सेंटीमीटर्स फोर थर्टी टू मीटर्स सिक्सटी नाइन सेंटीमीटर सो दिस इज द आंसर ऑफ एक्सरसाइज वन डॉट वन एंड राइट द गिवेन मेजर्स इन मीटर्स एंड सेंटीमीटर्स नाउ विल डू द सेकेंड एक्सरसाइज दट इज एक्सप्रेस द गिवेन मेजर्स इन मीटर्स यूजिंग डेसीमल नोटेशन सो दिस इज exactly the opposite that we have done in the first exercise which is write the given measures in meters and centimeters so let's see how we are going to finish this exercise so the first question question a 6 meters 32 centimeters so how you are going to measure this in meters using decimal notation so the answer is 6.32 meters 6.32 meters so that is 6 meter 32 cm if you want to measure this in meters then using the decimal notation then we have to write 6 Point then three two centimeter then six point three two meters. So we are going to measure this in meters. That's why we have to write six point three two meters. Next question forty centimeter. Forty centimeter means if we are going to measure this in meters using decimal notation, then we have to write. Zero point four zero meter because there is no meters here, so this is lesser than one meter. So that's why it is zero point four zero meter. We are going to measure this in meters. That's why we have to write in meters. Similar way in the say in the next uh, exercise, next question. Ninety eight centimeters. So similarly, we have to write zero point nine eight meters. Answer is zero point nine eight meters. Next question D eight meters six centimeters. So that's again eight point six meter. We are measuring in meters. That's why you have to write eight point six meter. Next question E fourteen. Meters forty two centimeters. So again fourteen point four two meters. This is the answer. Next question F thirty two meters fourteen centimeters. Again you have to follow the same pro same process thirty two point one four meters. That is thirty two point one four meters. Next question G. Eleven meters thirty nine centimeters. Again, same eleven point three nine meters. This is the answer. Then next is question H twenty four meters nineteen centimeter. Again twenty four point one nine meters. So these are the answers of exercise number two. Express the given measures in meters. using decimal notation now we will do the exercise number 3 express the given measures in kilometers using decimal notation so we have already learned about uh, the prefixes and the meaning and the value of kilo hecto deca deci centi milli so 1000 means kilo or kilo means 1000 hecto means 100 deca means 
ten, deci means one tenth, centi means one hundred, milli means one thousands. And we have also learned about units, units of length, units of weight, units of capacity. So here in this exercise, we will do the exercise on units of length. Units of length we have learned kilometer, hectometer, decameter, meter, decimeter, centimeter, millimeter. So decimeter, centimeter, millimeter, they are these are smaller units. Meter is standard units, and kilometer, hectometer, decameter, these are larger units. Let's do the exercise now. So the first question is. A six kilometers four hectometers two decameter seven meters. So we have to express this in kilometers. So here six kilometers. So we will start with six point because we will be using decimal notation. So here we have to do we have to measure in kilometers. That's why here six point. So we will start with six point. Then four hectometer. So that means hectometer means hundred. Hecto means hundred. So four. Then two decameter. Two means deca means ten. So here two. It will come after four. So four two. Then seven meters. So after that seven. So it will come tot in total. It will come. Six point four two seven kilometers. So the next question is thirty three kilometers nine hectometers. So we will start with thirty three point because we have to express in kilometers. So thirty three point. Then nine hectometers. So thirty three point nine. Kilometers. Then question C nine meter. So we have to express this in kilometers. So here there is no kilometer. So we have to start with zero point. Then there is no hectometers. So that also will be zero. Then there is no decameter. So that also will be zero. So Zero point zero zero nine, because we are expressing nine meters to in kilometers. So the answer will be zero point zero zero nine kilometers. Next question, question D, eight forty kilometers nine decameter. So We we'll start with 840 point because we have to measure in kilometers. 840 point. Here there is no hectometer, so that will be zero. Then nine decameter, so nine. So the answer is 840 point zero nine kilometers. Next question: 12 kilometers six meter. So here we will start with twelve point. Then there is no hectometer, so zero. That will be zero. Then there is no decameter. That will also be zero. Then six meter. So the answer is twelve point zero zero six kilometers. The next question: F fourteen kilometers. Seven decameter. So we'll start with fourteen point because fourteen kilometers, fourteen points. Then there is no hectometer, so that will be zero. So fourteen point zero, then seven decameter, then fourteen point zero seven kilometers. So answer is answer is fourteen point zero seven kilometers. So these are the Answers of exercise number three. Express the 
गिवेन मेजर्स इन किलोमीटर्स यूजिंग डेसिमल नोटेशन